Hey guys, it's Jenny Silver, and today I want to talk to those of you who are artists who create visual artwork. Whether you are a painter, you create drawings, you're a photographer, you're a videographer, you're a graphic designer, I want to talk to you about how you can make more money than just simply working for clients or selling completed pieces of artwork. There's a lot of potential for you to make additional income online, so I want to talk to you about my favorite ways for artists to make money online. First, if you can digitize your artwork, if you can either take a photo of it or scan it in high quality and upload it to your computer, then you can create a print-on-demand business. Print-on-demand means that you use a third-party company that will then print your unique design to a variety of different products and fulfill the orders from customers by shipping out those completed products to the customers. Printful is my favorite company that does this service and Printful integrates with a variety of different marketplaces and website platforms in order to create a seamless, efficient, and fairly simple shop to operate. Once you create and upload your original design, you then will be able to integrate it across many different varieties of platforms. Yes, you're still going to need to market your online shop or your items, but the best part is that once a customer finds you and they want to purchase from you, everything is automated from there on out. Printful will actually create the products once they are purchased automatically and they will ship it out to the customer and you don't have to do anything in terms of manufacturing or shipping. Next is selling your artwork through digital digital downloads. Many individuals are on the hunt for digital pieces of artwork that they can print themselves in order to save money. Next is selling your photos and videos as stock. Stock websites will allow you to create a profile, upload your photos or videos, and then you will receive royalties anytime someone purchases that stock photo for use. Next is creating a low content book through use of Kindle Direct Publishing on Amazon. Many of you may not realize that you can actually sell self-publish on Amazon and Amazon will directly fulfill the orders themselves through Kindle Direct Publishing. Now, if you have a significant amount of artwork or photography and you want to create a book to sell on Amazon, then you'll be able to do that through Kindle Direct Publishing. Another way that you can make income through Kindle Direct Publishing is that you can create a low or no content book, such as a journal. If you have original artwork, you can design a cover for a journal and then upload that cover along with blank journal pages. Kindle Direct Publishing not only publishes your book on Amazon's website, but it also takes care of the print fulfillment and shipping to the customer. That means that once you have uploaded a book or a journal for sale on Amazon, you simply will just take in royalties once Amazon receives a sale. Using a software such as BookBolt or Tangent Templates will be a way for you to generate or create the internal pages that will go inside of your book. If you have original artwork or if you do graphic design or if you have beautiful photos that people may want to have on the cover of a journal or similar low content book available on Amazon, then this is a great way to collect royalties once you have created the product. Next is selling your editing presets. If you are a photographer or a videographer and you have a set of specific presets that you use to edit on programs such as Lightroom, Photoshop, Premiere Pro, etc., then you can actually sell those editing presets. And sell these on your own unique website or you can also use a marketplace facilitator such as Etsy. Next is creating a blog. If you gear your blog content towards artists in a similar niche, then you will be able to not only upload photos of the process of making your art as well as the final artwork and the technique, but you can then also make money off of that content. You can either use Google AdSense to place ads on your blog content and receive money that way, or you can also integrate affiliate marketing. Affiliate marketing is when you partner with a company and they give you a specialized link to input into your content. Anytime that anyone utilizes a sale made from that link, then you receive a commission. If you're an artist and you have certain tools that you prefer, for example, if you're a photographer and you have a specific camera and lens series that you like best, or if you're a painter and you have a specific type of canvas or paintbrushes that you like, then you can link to those specific tools. Anytime anyone finds your content online, clicks through the affiliate link and makes a purchase because they saw you use that item in your blog, then you make commission.
To start in affiliate marketing, you're going to need to partner with companies. And the easiest way to do that is to join an affiliate network. Aircel, ClickBank, Rakuten, as well as Amazon affiliates are some of the most easy to get started with. Next is selling your artwork, your graphic design, your fonts, and many other different things on Creative Market. Creative Market allows you to sell your artwork and creations with a commercial license. So the individuals who are looking for original artwork, specialized fonts, themes, templates, etc., can then utilize those products and download them digitally and implement them into their websites, their own products for sale, etc. The last two are going to require a significant amount of additional work and are not just simply implementing work that you've already created in a new product. Websites such as Udemy, Skillshare, Outschool, and Coursera allow you to create and launch a course and sell it to customers that are already searching their database for your specific content. If you're able to create an instructional video on how to either perform a certain technique, learn a certain skill, or create a certain type of work of art that you know how to do, then you will be able to sell it as a course. Some platforms allow you to teach courses live, whereas others will have evergreen courses where you create the course once, upload the videos, and then students can download them on demand. If you want to create your own courses on your own unique website and create a series of lead magnets, opt-ins, etc., then I recommend using Kajabi. Lastly is creating a YouTube channel. Similarly to creating a course, if you're able to share any sort of knowledge, how-to video, technique, product review, then you can create a YouTube channel surrounding that topic. Additionally, a big niche on YouTube that receives lots of views are time-lapse videos of artists creating a piece of artwork from start to finish. If you are not interested in creating a tutorial video or talking to the camera, you also can film yourself creating the artwork piece and create a time-lapse video to get views. Now, creating a YouTube channel will take quite some time before you're able to actually generate income from YouTube ads because it can take quite a great deal of time in order to get monetized. But while you're waiting for monetization and trying to increase your reach on YouTube, you can implement affiliate marketing in order to try to generate some income. Okay, you guys, I hope that was helpful. Please click like, subscribe, and leave me a comment down below. If someone is looking for how to create a certain, if some, if someone is lurk, lurking, <laughs> if someone's lurking, always lurking on the internet. If someone is lurking, <laughs> lurking,